What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Jaden's ex-girlfriend speaks on her leaving her to get back with Bluefus. I want her to be happy if Bluefus makes her happy then. Let's get it. To be happy. And if that's who makes her happy, then who am I to... Like, I'm, then I'm happy for her, period. So, yeah, I mean, obviously, like, different... Hold on. I just want her to be happy. And if that's who makes her happy, then who am I to... Like, the... I, I'm, then I'm happy for her, period. So, yeah, I mean, obviously, like, the friendship part is kind of sucks, but, you know. I really don't wish that on her. I hope that she gets treated the best. I hope I hope she gets treated deserves because she really does. She deserves everything. Um, she's a great mother, a great person. She deserves absolutely the world. And so I hope that she gets that. 100%. This is how the video look, y'all. Was he wearing blue face clothes? No. Why does everybody say that? I was not wearing his clothes. I literally have the sweater. And I'm going to show it to you right now because people were saying that about me. And I just want her to be happy. <laughs> and if that's who makes her happy, then I'm a, who am I to? I'm going to show y'all that because not y'all saying she wearing blue face clothes. Um, I'm not surprised that Jaden went back to blue face, right? Duh. I'm going to just let y'all know right now, Jaden is going to get the last laugh. Jaden is the one that complies with the law. <laughs> Jaden has the songs. Jaden has the label. And uh, I guess Jaden is going to have the man. But Jaden was going to forever get the man. You know what I'm saying? Um do I think, like, having Bluefoot is a prize? I do not. However, um, you know, if that's what this is, then that's what this is. But it's just, it's so much going on, bro. I just, I wish she didn't. That's all I got. I wish she didn't. But she did, like we thought she would, so here we are. Now, let's get into this Portia girl, <laughs> this Portia and her husband situation. I want to find the first post on it. Hot shot. No. The sun is going now. Uh, where is it at? I want to find, okay, here it is. Portia files for divorce from Simon, or however you say his last name, after 15 months of marriage, okay? Y'all know who Portia is from um, Real Housewives of Atlanta. She fi filed for divorce. Now, y'all know he was with my good sis, Fallon. Um, Fallon is absolutely a friend, but he was with my good sis, Fallon, and you know, he said a lot of things about Fallon that weren't so true. Um, so we all knew it would catch up with him. But the fact that Portia is filing for divorce is crazy. So basically, um, he's been doing a, a lot of illegal things that got him in the position that he's in today. So all the illegal things that he's done has caught up to him and they are deporting his ass. But let me read what this says over here. All right. Um, woo. Here's some shocking news to start your Friday morning. Portia Williams has reportedly filed for a divorce from her husband, Simon Guabadia. I might be saying it wrong, but um, after 15 months of marriage, the news of the, their split has shocked fans and followers as the couple had tied the knot in a lavish ceremony just over a year ago. According to the court documents obtained by People, the Real Housewives star filed for divorce from him in Atlanta, marking the end of their whirlwind romance. The couple's relationship had been a topic of discussion in the media with rumors swirling about him or his citizenship status. However, a source close to 
The couple has clarified that the divorce is not related to these recent allegations. The reason behind the split remains undisclosed with an insider describing it was an ongoing matter. Williams, 42, and uh, him, 59, exchanged vows in Nigerian traditional native law and custom ceremony, followed by American ceremony in Atlanta, November 2022. Their quick engagement after just one month of dating had raised eyebrows, but the couple seemed deeply in love, as evident from their social media posts. The big news comes just days after Portia announced her return for upcoming 16th season of the Bravo series, adding the, another layer of intrigue to her personal life, which means she just created um, a storyline for herself. Is the best way that I can put that. Okay. So, yeah, um, here we are with that, y'all. I, mm, we all knew this wasn't going to work. I mean, let's just, let, let me not sugarcoat it. We knew this wasn't going to work. We all knew this wasn't going to work. I feel like it was fake from the jump. I feel like it was forced from the jump. Now, her... I'm not going to say she married him to basically for his citizenship to help with his citizenship. That would be alleged. I don't know, but absolutely. Mm. <laughs> I'm not shocked to say the least. Um, so this was Fallon's reaction. <laughs> This was Fallon. Fallon responds to the question about Simon being single following his divorce with Portia. What? Now that Simon is single. Oh! Oh! His money might be available. So Fallon. She said the answer is no, baby. She ain't got nothing to do with it. Her name Bennett and she ain't in it. Fallon shouldn't have never been with him in the first place. I'm not going to lie um, for so many reasons. But, girl, here we are. Um, so that's kind of that on that. Um, I think her decree, she said he was abused. I wouldn't be surprised by that. Um, I just wouldn't be surprised. Here goes the next thing on it. Portia breaks silence after filing for divorce from Simon. He also responds to fans amid divorce and immigration drama. Will stop loving my wife when divorce is final. Child. She said, thank you all for your prayers and support. Okay. Um, he said, will stop loving my wife when the divorce is final. Now, I ain't gonna lie. That's some narcissistic shit to say. <laughs> like... I ain't going to stop loving her until it's final. Shut up. <laughs> uh, okay. It saddens me to hear about the divorce. I also think about the vows you both took for better or for worse. The first test that came against your marriage, your wife ran to the divorce court. Respectfully, it makes one think that the marriage was a marriage of convenience and not love. Despite all of that, what about your children whose lives were blended as a family? No one thinks about how the children are affected in the end. Divorce is easy. Hmm? Marriage is hard work. I wish you both the best in your lives ahead. He said respect. Um, if immigration finds out your sponsor, be it your wife or other, has a criminal record, it ain't going to fly with immigration. He said, yeah. But she doesn't have anything. What water can... What water can do to rock? Enjoy your African brother. Exactly. I hope things turn out good for you. Be strong and prayerful. Bro, I'm not going to lie. This is a bit of like, it's kind of, it's not even kind of gaslighting. It's gaslighting. She don't want to be with you no more, gang. We know that she ain't done nothing illegal unless she did something illegal with you. And if she did do something illegal with him, then we're all going to find that out. But as far as I'm concerned, I think she dodged the bullet. Definitely think Fallon dodged the bullet. Um, so y'all let me know what y'all think about all of this down in the comment section below. Because, girl, that's all I got. Um, fucking Jaden and Buki. 
it wasn't meant to be in the first place. I feel like, um, but Jaden going back to Bluefus, let's just not act like we're surprised. None of us can act like we're surprised. Okay. Y'all let me know what y'all think about all of this down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.